In the beginning of the 90s, Mark Weiser from Xerox Park imagined a future where computers would not be the center of attention, but would instead blend into the background, integrated into everyday objects and activities, becoming quiet and invisible servants. Moore's Law and similar trends have allowed us to believe that the age of ubiquitous computing would inevitably come, with chips becoming ever smaller, faster, and cheaper. After the ages of mainframe computing, personal computing, and mobile computing, we are now in an age where computers are all around us, improving our lives and augmenting human capabilities. As important as the presence of computers all around us is the question of how these can communicate. The Auto ID Center, led by Sanjay Sarma, drove research on RFID technology to create the architecture for the Internet of Things. Today, the terms ubiquitous computing and Internet of Things are more or less interchangeable. For these visions to reach their full realization, smaller chips and interconnectivity are not the whole answer. Printed electronics technologies bring sensing, powering, and display capabilities that are lightweight, low cost, and provide freedom of form factor enabling computing to be embedded into any object or surface. Companies in this field are already applying these technologies in fields ranging from smart cards, toys, medical applications, security, packaging, and logistics. Unlike the Internet, however, the technologies that enable the Internet of Things are not as easily accessible. Most printed electronics technologies are only accessible to large companies and R&D institutes. That is why we decided to create Printu. Printu allows anyone to easily prototype using printed electronics technologies. We believe that by making these technologies accessible, we lower the barriers of entry for innovation in the Internet of Things and encourage new ideas and products to come to life. Much like the openness of the Internet allowed for thousands of startups to emerge with new uses for it, an open Internet of Things is necessary to generate a similar wave of innovation, much like Chris Anderson predicts in his book, Makers, The New Industrial Revolution. Help create the future by backing Printu on Kickstarter.